I don't believe in queens. Oh no. Let's see. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Let's React. I'm Kenny and this is Montana. And today we're going to be reacting to season three, episode 10 of Korra, Long Live the Queen. Long Live the Queen. That does not sound good. No, given the fact that the queen is frankly awful, I'm not in favor of a long life for her to be H. She ate Bosco. She, 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 <laughs> yeah. she can leave. No. Nah. <laughs> if you like the series and want to continue with us through book three and book four, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below for Korra reaction content every Thursday and Sunday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Also, comment down below any TV shows you'd like to see us react mm -hmm. to. We're looking Looking at she run the princesses of power we're looking at young justice clone wars attack on titan there's a lot of options teen titans is one of my favorite shows of all time i would love to watch it or we could watch movies we could watch the mcu there's really anything you guys want options Please comment i have down very below. limited exposure comment down below what you'd like to see uh we're open to a bunch of different options and we're going to be putting out polls on the community tab of our page to see what people want to see but yeah let us know also join the patreon link in the description below if you want to see episodes early and ask us the questions after every Every episode. All right, I'm super excited for this episode. How are you feeling? I think it's gonna be great. All right, let's get it. Let's go. Listen up, Dunderheads. This video was brought to you by the incredible members of the Let's React Patreon. If you want access to a ton of exclusive perks, check out the link in the description below. Have a good day, Twinkle Toes. Long live the queen. All right, where are we? Yeah. You have to let me out. Oh. The Earth Queen is in what danger from doing? a group of terrorists calling what? themselves the Red Lotus. She can breathe now, fire. I to one of them in the spirit world yesterday. Oh, that's He's why. Insane. Screaming about terrorists in the spirit world. You're the one who sounds insane. Well, they, they were there. Like, she's the avatar. Okay. You have to believe the avatar. I'm sorry. Not good. Really? <laughs> Sami has like one chain. Did yeah. Way, it's going to be so uncomfortable. Oh. Sorry, ma'am. I'm under orders. <laughs> She's trying to seduce him. <laughs> Where am I gonna go? Please. Oh. Well, as long as you're chained up, I. It doesn't make a difference. You gotta pause it. Why? <laughs> this is for children. <laughs> and you got my dad flustered. Can you please chain me to the wall? Daddy! <laughs> he said, let's just make Montana panic. No, this is for kids! <laughs> How are they doing this? Can you imagine if you had seen this as a kid? <laughs> the way they animate her is just different. Let's After go. some water. She's thirsty. She <laughs> needed to recover. <laughs> Can I have some water? No water. We're also not going to bring you any rocks or fire, so don't ask. <laughs> <laughs> there, but there's nothing we can do about that. We're not opening your compartment. Foreshadowing, maybe? Ah. I hoped Mako and Bolin would have shown up to save us She has a now. plan. I wonder if they were okay. Oh. I thought Tommy had some sort of plan with being chained to the wall. If you're holding us hostage or give you some leverage to use against the Avatar, you're going to be very disappointed. Can't we just she didn't give a shit about us. Yeah. <laughs> she can't well, fucking stand us. Back in South <laughs> you had her paralyzed. Why didn't you just take her out when you had the chance? Look, all you need to know is that the world is about to change for yeah. the better. So they want her. Are they thinking they're just gonna like break her mind somehow? Like Or like hypnosis. Something weird. Meditation or the Dai Li have that technique, like mind manipulation. Mind so, bending. Years, huh? That must have been like crazy boring. Actually it was only thirteen years, but it 30. felt like thirty. I'm sure. What did you do with all that time? Did you sing songs, work on crafts? Not a lot of craft supplies in a volcanic prison cell. He says so I must have renamed no the constellations about a thousand times. Oh my God. When it rained, that was a big event. Oh, I would have killed for some rain. Mostly oh. I just made up stories about the guards, who was having trouble with his girlfriend, which one secretly wished he'd become a pastry chef. Ooh, okay, that sounds like fun. Let me try that on you guys. So they're kind of normal people. They just sister. have... Your mustache you know what? Something I'm picking up on is the fact that none of these people seem nefarious as mm. much as they seem dedicated to a cause. They have sort of a cult-like thing where they're like, oh yeah, we're super nice to you, but they, I mean, if we need to, we're just going to chop off your head. It tells you they really believe in what they're doing. They seem very dedicated to each other and committed to this, like, like they have their, like, coat of arms or whatever, and then they all stick to it, mm -hmm. which is why they didn't see it coming. Coat when... of arms. What? Mingwa doesn't have arms. 
That was horrible. I'm sorry and funny. not on purpose. None of them seem like genuinely evil individuals. Yeah. To them, they're doing what is right for the world. And I'm sensing, just sensing, an unspoken attraction between you two. Oh. I can feel you tremble when we touch. Heart been broke so many times. Oh no. Damn. friends with the bad guys. No, Sorry. he oh, said. On. Gag those two. We're almost there. Oh boy. So they're right. just gonna How are they in? gonna get into bo yeah? What's the point of having um, a giant uh, wall of bossing say if you can just drive through? Don't worry, I have a plan. These airships that Cabbage Corp sold to the Earth Kingdom are way cheaper than the ones from oh, Space built. She hey. can break that bar. She did have a plan. Oh, with her strong legs. Oh. Oh. Now that's just shoddy workmanship. Damn. There's no what is she gonna do? What is she gonna do? I need the keys. Beat the crap out of a guard. Whoa. Give me five minutes, then start yelling for help. Wow. Her technological Damn, knowledge is coming into play. Oh my god. Play. Wow. Yay. Wait, She's getting her moment. Or like more of a moment. Already left Fort Bosco and should be arriving in a Fort few Bosco. hours. Excellent. How does she live with herself? As soon as it lands. Yes, you're Bring Majesty. it to me. But she said about the avatar. People here who captured two of the avatars. Oh friends. no. They would like to present them to you personally. You know I don't meet with bounty hunters. And of course I told them that. But they say they have some information that might interest you. Oh about boy. The location of your stolen Wait. airbender. So here's been saying that he they should kill off world leaders. Is he about Is to he just, just come in and murder her? Try to get to the world leader. What do you think? I mean, that certainly would be a way of inciting anarchy. He so directly was like, the core was like, you can't kill all the world leaders. And he's like, wouldn't it be better like, if they I were? Can. I think he's about to like two birds, one stone. Let me just try. Yeah. Oh, no. Well, the Dylee will probably save her or something, but. Maybe. Really? <clears throat> Fine. Send them in. Mm. Ah, yes. I remember these two. We'll find an acceptable home for you in prison with the rest of the dissidents. Now, I'm told oh, you have some information I don't like for this. Me. This is I really this scary. There are a bunch of daily agents, though. Yeah. Bounty. Well, we don't want any bounty, Your Majesty. You can consider these two a thank you gift for simply taking the time to talk to us. How very magnanimous. So, where are my airbenders? I'd be happy to tell you. Once you hand the avatar over to me. Who told you that we have the avatar? How I know is not important. But if I found out, oh, interesting. others will too. Oh, boy. And that could put you in a difficult position. Is Oh, so. I see. Your Majesty, imprisoning the avatar will cause the other nations to turn against you and That's demand true. your freedom. Before long, so here's a master in manipulator. A international incident. But if you let me take her today, no one need ever know she was here. And you can get your airbenders back without interference. We both win. And what do you plan to do with the Avatar? Should wow. I see fit to grant you What do best? you plan to do? All I can do? say is that I have business with her. What? And she won't be bothering it, you. It's so that. scary. I can assure you of that. Ugh. And I, God, hearing that about your friend yeah. would just be awful. I find these terms agreeable. Okay, so he's working Done. with her. All right. I escort them to the antechamber until the Avatar's arrival. Send these two to the dungeon. Okay. Ah. Oh my god. Send them to the dungeon. Just drop. Good lord. I guess just fall damage doesn't Guard. exist here. Yeah. Here. Something happened to my friend. She needs help. Where is she? Oh yeah. Queen. <laughs> Not spinning the ring of keys. Nice work. I can't with this now woman. Let's take control of this ship. Wow. She's a metal bender now. Wait, is she gonna do kind of a top like thing? This looks like the kind of room they fought. Just take the airship. Yeah. yeah. We're going down in quadrant four of the Seafloor Desert. Damn. So they did like alert people. So. I think you might okay. Have been a little over aggressive with the airbending. The controls are busted. Is she gonna jump out with Asami? Also, you broke the radio. Sorry, but it's not my fault this airship's a hunk of junk. <laughs> Hang on to something! So oh, now no. they know exactly where they went down. Dang. 
But this means I here can't get her yet. Okay. He keeps like getting to the point where he should definitely get her. Exactly, and then, and then there's one slight yeah. problem. This is a good landing, but given our location, I'm not so sure about that. You're the engineer. What do you think? Can we get it flying again? It doesn't look good. I mean, even if you metal bend the propellers back into shape, we'd have to dig this whole thing out of the sand. Sand bending? Is everyone all right? Like you oh. care. What the heck happened? She said her friend needed help, then they knocked me out. I'm sorry, but I couldn't let you take me to the Earth Queen. They're as imprisoned. Captive. There are dangerous mm -hmm. forces at work that you don't know anything about. More dangerous than being stranded in the desert? Don't worry, Kong. I radioed Bossing Say before we went down. We just need to sit tight. Someone will be here soon to rescue us. I'm not waiting around for that. This is an interesting interaction. Yeah, because they're all in the same boat now. The ship up and Literally. <laughs> not likely. I just tunneled out of the engine room. It's like a sandbox in there. This ship isn't going anywhere. And neither are you. You're mm. our prisoners, and it's our duty to transport you to the Earth Queen. Um, you realize that they have the no Avatar, chance, right? You don't want to fight me. I'm afraid you weren't giving us much of a choice. We have our orders. They're gonna lose. What? Well, who's oh. coming? Sandbenders. sandbenders? It was probably just a mirage. No, it's the, the sandbenders. No, or they came back. That's no mirage. Look. It's a creature. Or maybe it's someone coming for the airship. Oh, spirit. Or they were. Everybody be blaming stuff on Cora. Right? Let's get to work. Everybody stand back. Come on, Queen. And then all those people on the ship are going to be like, how are we supposed to hate her? This person. Yeah, she's literally like. We have to find a way out of here before Zahir gets his hands on Cora. Well, he could meddle. Take me bend. with you. I haven't seen my wife and five kids in four years. Four years. Well, the first few months were great. I could finally get some sleep, but oh, now I really miss them. Yeah. <laughs> what? Listen, Bolin, this is up to you. I know you can metal bend. You can metal bend? No. Yes, you can. I believe in you. I believe in you too, oh. Bolin. I He's just never that, done it. Fellow, yeah. I don't man, think he can. I've been trying and trying and Maybe trying he just has to focus enough. To Not yeah. even a little. You've always had the ability deep down. You just haven't had the right motivation. But this is your time. Get us out of here to save Korra. You can do it. Bolin. Oh, Bolin. no. Bolin. That's terrifying. Get the social anxiety to help. Bolin. That works. You're right. Okay. Here I go. Metal he can't do it. No, there's no way. Is there no earth around them? It has to be. I can't Aww. metal bend. Oh, that's so that's sad. You guys didn't happen to bring any toilet paper, did you? Oh no. <laughs> COVID-19. <laughs> Lynn is just pissed. Oh. See, like, that car was CGI. <laughs> how do you not see how that's boxier and more, like, cartoon? Like, see? Do you see the difference? She's drawn, that's a cartoon. Sorry, that's CGI. No. Oh. Oh. Hi, sweetie. She's like, you broke my ball, but I still love you. I love you. You scared the life out of me. Now you want to lick me. <laughs> Baboon. Oh my god. <laughs> Lynn with animals is very fun. Here, she wants <gasps> and leave me alone. Oh. Tonrock, you read me? Tonrock. I found Cora's Jeep, but the kids aren't here. Meet me at the Misty Palms Oasis. Okay, so they're on the she's All on right. the trail. Detective uh Lynn. Oh yeah, saw me with the welding. How's it looking in there? I just air bent all the sand out of the engine room. I think it's clean. It hasn't been that clean since it floated off the showroom floor. How's it going out here? I think she might be able to limp out of the desert. Okay. Oh, you want to see if you can get the engine started? Aye, aye. Are they still going to try to hold her captive? They have no shot. I feel like they can't, right? Yeah. All right! No way. Oh. No! Oh my oh, goodness! Oh god! Um... Uh, uh, it just keeps coming. 
Holy. Um. That's not a spirit? That's just an animal. What? I think it's gone for now. Uh. Oh, you all right? They were right what about to take do? off, too. All of our supplies were on the ship. We've got no food, no water. Oh, no. Easy, Arik. Another ship is on the way. We just need to hold our position for a few hours. And get eaten by we that thing. We have a few hours. Yeah. How far are we from the edge of the desert? Too far to walk, if that's what you think. You can't just wait around for that thing to pick us off one by one. You'll can Cora sand bend? Now get a hold of yourself. Oh, she can, yeah. Maybe we can still build something to get us all out of here. You want to make some wings out of scrap some... metal and flap real hard? No, oh. but we might have enough material to construct a makeshift sand sailor. Oh, like yeah. The sandbenders used to get around. All we need is a sail and some kind of sled to attach it to. It's worth a try. Gather every wow. piece of metal you can find. We'll give that sandy beast a run for his money yet. Wow. All right. Oh, fancy Pilly. Right. Looks like he's in a hurry. He looks kind of cool Here. with the, the eye. Yeah. Cooler than the other guy. Yeah. I don't think you have the facilities for that big man. I wonder if they're related. Hmm. Come on. Your Majesty, we received a distress signal from the airship carrying the prisoners. We believe the ship crashed I in the Seabong Desert and the Avatar may have escaped. This is outrageous! Send another airship to retrieve the Avatar immediately. It's already on its way, Your Majesty. What are we going to do now? Oh boy. There's no way we can track her down in the desert before the Queen gets to her. You really think they'll be lucky enough to capture her again? She'll be long gone by the time they arrive. No way. It doesn't matter. We're through chasing her. It's time to make her come to us. How? What is this riffraff doing in my throne room unannounced? Apologies, Your Majesty, but I couldn't help overhearing that the Avatar won't be joining us today. The Avatar is still in my custody. However, eavesdropping on royal conversations will land you in a cell right next to those boys you brought in. Now, if you value your freedom, you'll tell me where the airbenders are right now. That wasn't the deal. I will not bandy words with bounty hunters. Seize these hoodlums and throw them in prison. Nah, not until a good they move. decide to show proper respect for the crown. <laughs> Yeah, did they not see the eye? What do you think is gonna happen? He punched them back? Yep. Gazan's kinda skilled. Yeah. Not just with lava bending, like his earth bending. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I don't think I'm gonna be helping you. Get back here and lay down your life for your queen! <laughs> you coward! Oh boy. You wouldn't dare attack a queen! Uh Oh boy. What do you think he's been Maybe doing? I forgot to mention something to you. Oh. I don't believe in queens. Oh no. What's he? Oh. Oh. Um Are you kidding me? Oh my god, he's literally You think freedom is he's something just... that you can get. He's just taking her. He's suffocating her. Air. Oh my god, her blood Freedom vessels and her eyes are popping. Air. No. It, oh my god. There is no, life. no, are you kidding? Darkness. Oh. Oh my god. He just... So, so there's no more Earth Queen. <laughs> he just murdered someone. Air bent the air out of her lungs. So it just collapsed her lungs in on themselves. Holy, that is the worst way to. Can you imagine trying to breathe stop, in? Stop, stop, stop. So this is not a kids show counter. No. Nope. Uh. <laughs> That's wow. About okay. Number four, I think. Wow. Okay, so now there's no Earth Queen and the Dai Li are on the run. He's gonna occupy Ba Sing Se. But does he even want Ba Sing Se occupied? Because he doesn't believe in rulers. He's occupying it in order to, to lure Korra there. 
probably gonna make stuff happen where mm. she's like, I need to go to Bossing Tay and fix this. Interesting. Sorry, I, I just can't get over it that she she just had the air bent out of her lungs. Like that just reoccurred to me. The fact that she me. was like chasing it with her hands. And that he gave a philosophical freaking uh, like, your people need freedom. Like, like you, you need, need air, air as he's taking Bo it from like, her. Oh I, uh, my goodness. Okay. Hey, you can't be in Are they just gonna murder no everybody? I just need to make an announcement to the entire city. How do I do that? Who do you think you are? In charge now. He's the man who just took down the Earth Queen. Yeah, Not she's next? dead. Oh Ming no. Wong, please. We're here to help citizens like him. Not hurt them. Now, can like, you help me? He's a man of a strong moral backbone. But it's just the wrong morality. Well, there's just no reason to kill these people. Attention citizens of Ba Sing Se. I have an important announcement to make. Moments ago, the Earth Queen was brought down at the hands of revolutionaries, including myself. Oh. I'm not going to tell you my name, because my identity is not important. I'm not here to take over the Earth Kingdom. I think you had enough of leaders telling you what to do. It's time for you to find your own path. He's going to no open the ring. will you be oppressed by tyrants. From now on, you are free. I deliver Ba Sing Se back into the hands oh my gosh. of the people. Is he gonna take down the whole wall with magma? No way. That'd be sick. No. Like you. So there are no more rings. There's no more division. Oh my goodness. Wow. Holy crap. How did that not hurt anyone? And now they're gonna go reclaim from the right. ruling class their yeah. their uh their power. Wow. Did they hear that the announcement too? Yeah. So here came here to take out the Earth Queen, and now Korra is Okay, next. but he okay. You know that guy? He's my hero. If you can just go through one more of the bars, Wait, you could escape. Come on. I know you can do it. This is your time. Oh, the guy who announced it. You said before was my time. I know I did, but now it's really your He can't time. meddle then. No way. Do it. Yes, King. Nope. Did you see that? No. I did it. I mean, not for us, but I meddled in all the other cells open. I don't think that was you. Damn. Oh. Listen to me. Crap. I'm going to set you free, but I want to talk to you first. Whoa. I have a message that I need you to take to court. He's so interesting. Yeah. A really unique villain. Yeah. Just his un unwavering calm mm -hmm. she ain't pretty but i think she'll do the job no time for a test run let's move oh no yeah they're trying oh my goodness all right <sighs> hate that yep oh. maybe turn right or left yeah. any direction or maybe they don't ah. trust the turning Oh my or God. maybe that thing can turn also because it's just a giant sand shark. Sand shark, yeah, that feels right. I think he's gone. I feel like right. no, it's gonna come. Yeah. yeah. Mouth wide oh. open. Mouth wide oh. open. Mouth wide open. Oh. oh. Yeah, it's a sand shark. Wow, it's pretty cool looking. Yeah. Wow, I can't believe they have that. <laughs> fire in the belly. Is that dragon? I, I thought I saw a dragon. One. Oh, okay. I yeah, feel I like think that Zuko and Tonrock probably came okay. to Misty, wherever. Gotcha. That's where they came. <laughs> Just long enough. Yeah, you know. You want to buy a slightly used sand sailor? <laughs> <laughs> Iconic. Thanks, Asami. We've got a big Asami episode. I'm sorry for getting us stranded out there. I didn't mean for that to happen. You know, whatever the conflict between you and the queen is, I'm sure it's above my pay grade. Oh. You got a tough job. Good luck, Avatar. Oh, all right. Captain, have we been in the desert too long, or is that really a dragon over there? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh, let's go get it. Are we going to get a Zuko Core interaction? Ooh. Oh, come on, please. <laughs> no, no, yeah. no, wait, so she's back with Lin. Oh, thank goodness. So now it's just Mako and Bolin are trapped. Did you think we were coming yeah. back for you? Well, they're being let go, actually. Yeah. But I hear Nosy gonna draw them in somehow. Hmm. What are you all doing? Here? Oh yeah. Cora, you're safe. 
Oh my goodness. Yeah, we made it out of the desert, thanks to Asami. Do you remember Lord Zuko? Uh, I met you when you were a very young girl. Oh. It's good to see you again, Avatar. Yay! Cora. It's good to see you, Lord Zuko. Thanks for ditching me back at Zalfur. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. But how did you all find us? I am a detective, you know. <laughs> did you find She's like, how could you Lynn? doubt me? Some yeah. people at the inn saw them get captured by Zaheer's crew. Yikes. We don't know where they are. Did you hear about the Earth Queen? What about her? Once again, the Earth Queen's reign has come to an abrupt and violent end. That was ridiculous. That was so scary. Into chaos. Rioters and looters have overrun the palace. Wow. The Red Lotus. What's that? The name of the group that's been trying to capture me and just took out the Earth Queen. I'm afraid this is only the beginning, Dad. Oh, boy. Oh, no. oh baby. Wow. Wow. That was a ludicrous episode. Yeah. He air bent the air out of the queen's lungs. Just like, completely. Who? How do you stop that? How do you prevent him from doing that to anyone? You have to be just as powerful of an airbender. And like, you have to and bend it back into their lungs? Like I guess. I wonder if he does it to more people. Yeah, because that may be the other leaders. If he tries to Try bend to the air out of Zuko's lungs. Or Tonrock. That's not good. They're not safe. If you're a leader anywhere, you're not Lin. No, and then you couldn't even you couldn't even fight that because even you're you're fighting while your lungs are collapsing. Like you're not going to be able to. I think the only possible thing is that maybe the only way you can do it is if he's completely uninterrupted. Mm. And like if somebody's bending at him, he wouldn't have the power to do it. You know? Wow, a lot of discuss. If you like that, make sure to like, comment, subscribe down below. We're heading into the last four episodes of this season. The next one being titled "The Ultimatum." A lot of implications there. That could mean a lot of things. Things. Not good. Yeah. Mostly not good. Our next episode will be coming out this Sunday, 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so keep a lookout for that for now. Where are we headed? All right, let's go to the episode verdict. Thank you for watching that. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe down below for more core reaction content every Thursday at Sunday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Make sure to comment down below any series you want to see us react to after that. We're looking at Clone Wars, She-Ra and the Princesses of Power. We're looking at Young Justice, Teen Titans, a bunch of different things. Comment what you want to see and we will take a look. If you want to see episodes early or ask us the questions after every episode, make sure to check out the Patreon linked in the description below. Mark B92, you have had the top like question maybe five, six weeks in a row like hats off to Legendary. you. Legendary. I think we have to do it again. Mark B92 asks, after witnessing the dangerous power of airbending, does it make sense that airbenders from previous generations were taught and practiced avoidance and self-defense instead of offensive moves? That's really interesting because that question is kind of a chicken and the egg situation where yeah. the airbenders peaceful and nomadic and focused on offense because that was something that they valued mm -hmm. or did they have to focus on that because of the potential for their airbending oh. skills to be used as evil, you know? Maybe, is this Guru Lahima, like a airbender that was like, maybe there's more possibilities and maybe history tried to shut him up or something? Maybe. Or, I think you're right that it could be a chicken and egg situation. My suspicion is that there's always been this capability and from the beginning, the lion turtles maybe were like, you have to be very careful with this because it has the potential to be more deadly than the other ones. Is it necessarily more deadly though? Because couldn't a firebender just cook someone's lungs and couldn't a waterbender- No, they can't just put fire in there. You They're, can't, the you elements can't not, bend someone- You, you can't, cannot force fire to appear somewhere. You can bend it out of your hands or you can bend water over where it is, or you can bend earth over where it is, but air is everywhere. So, so it's okay. different. I still feel like in terms, like, yes, like conceptually speaking, you're right. But what if someone tries to bend the air in your lungs and you just go, you just go, not getting out. <laughs> that's fu That's funny. My question is, is air bending just like- What are you gonna do? CO2 or oxygen? Like, Interesting. Which one is it? I would like to know, are they gas benders? Yeah. <laughs> Well, I would explain far bending. Fart bending. All right. Um, but yeah, I think that that definitely makes sense why they were more self-defense rather than offensive moves. And it makes sense because Kai was like obliterating that poacher a couple episodes ago just with the usage of his airbending. Mm -hmm. So yeah, totally makes sense. All right. Bard McMullen asks, with the final events of this episode, what do you think this means for Bossing Se and the Earth Kingdom as a whole? I think I'm not really sure. Okay. I have an idea. So shall I lead off? Yes. Then? 
All right, I think a couple different things are going to happen. I think there's initially going to be the anarchy that he kind of talked about where the people who are in the lower rings or the people mm-hmm. who are at the very bottom of this caste system explore the upper rings mm. and people are going to flood the palace obviously because like with the, yeah the that's Dai the first have thing no you reason do. to say, exactly it seemed like there was a lot of like food shortage issues yeah. like and just generally speaking like a lot of so you think wealth is going to be leveled out exactly there's just a lot of wealth inequality mm-hmm. which i think is going to be fixed and in then- a very i think there's going to be this like temporary surge where everything kind of like tries to even out but mm-hmm. everyone's panicking and it's crazy, right? And I think Zaheer is going to kind of let that happen because yep. that was his whole point. He's I think encouraging it. Exactly. I think Korra is going to try to go manage it. But I think there's a potential for things to maybe get a little bit better, at least for some people, specifically yeah. for the poorer people mm-hmm. um, who are going to have access to resources now. And I think there's going to be a moment where it's like, you might not agree with my methods, but like you can't argue with the fact that like Bolin's family like now it's a little can, like, bit better feed everyone now. exactly yeah so I think that's what's gonna happen and I think Korra is gonna have a really big dilemma because she doesn't like the means of how he achieved it but yeah. the end result is not all bad huh that's an interesting take I, I agree with a lot of parts of that I think that it also means something bigger for the earth kingdom as a whole mm. I think it's gonna change the way things operate like I, I think there should be more councils than like one monarch leader oh 100 and I think that that's going to make clear like when stuff gets a little better they're going to be like maybe we change it up a little bit so i think that'll be good all right schreiber asks are there any interactions between cora and zuko that you'd like to see happen i'd like to see like i know that they're not connected technically anymore but she's still a reincarnation of ang i'd love to see her do something that ang used to do and then zuko be like Ugh. i'd love to see Zuko here or that's rough buddy like some sort of callback to what he used to say because Zuko was constantly dropping just incredible lines I want to see him get really frustrated like he would do all the time something a Zukoism I want to see happen to Korra which I think would be really funny interesting I want a Korra dragon moment I want her to meet oh yeah I want them to maybe fly together Druk I maybe want Naga and Druk to have an interaction I don't know I'm just big on the like animal helpers yeah so that'll be great All right, if you liked that episode, make sure to like, comment, subscribe down below, and keep a lookout for our next episode coming out this Sunday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. That's the ultimatum. Check out the Patreon link in the description below if you want to see that episode early or ask us the questions that we answered after every episode and give us input on what shows we're going to watch next. All right, I think that's about it. Are you excited for next episode? Very. I think it's going to be great. All right, let's get it. Let's go.